World of Fancy. The other one says Land of Fancy. This one says World of Fancy. And it says that it's by the sea. So maybe it's Sea World. Maybe it is Sea World. Did you get well? Yeah. <laughs> Mr. E's clue led us here. At least this time we're pretty sure that this yeah. is where we're supposed to be. Guys, what are we looking for? The clue and the key. A key, that's right. Kind of looking around here at the park to see if there's any <laughs> clue or a hint. An X where? Right here. In the sand? The dirt in an X mark. There was an X in the sand. Look at this. It's got the key. This is like a regular. This is what this will fit that hole. This will fit into that hole. Yeah! You wanna open up? Oh. Let me take you on a road. One family on a throne. Cause we got, we got it. We got treasures and more than shit we got. The day has come. We have the key and we have been waiting to open it up. Okay, okay I'm this, so excited. This, this lock is so intense. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, but it has this thing on it, okay. So, um, so we used this key to get off the bottom and lower this. Now we use this key to open up the hole inside the lock. And it now really hard to we have the out. third and final key to be able to finally <gasps> unlock it. We did it! Oh! 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 Are you we excited, Charlie? We can get it off past this point, so oh. I guess that's the end Wait, of what? the trip. Wait, what? Sorry, right? I was filming everyone's reactions. <laughs> What's going on? But we can't get it past this point, so I guess that's the end of the treasure hunt. Okay, bye. Okay. No! <laughs> <laughs> we have to keep trying. We won't give up. <laughs> no! We have to keep Ouch! Oh, you got it! Yeah, look, okay, it guys. could hang on there like that. Oops. Cool! Okay. <laughs> I'm so excited! <laughs> Come on, baby. You got this. I believe in you. Who's one of the keys? <gasps> Whoa. Whoa! Okay, let's clear a spot on the floor. <gasps> careful, careful. This is so old. It's actually sticking it's to the It's stuck top. to the roof <gasps> of the box. It's all old Disney stuff. Old and this Disney fell out. Magazines? A map? Should we look at this map first? Or should yeah. we look at the stuff first? Let's, let's look at stuff. all the stuff. Okay. So we'll save that look treasure at this. map. <gasps> old oh, yellow? Oh, some of the stuff came off of the roof of it. Like some of the wood stuck to this. Well, how long so, has it been in there? Oh, Walt Jiminy, Disney. Jiminy Cricket. Walt Disney's Jiminy Cricket. I didn't Walt even Disney's know. Walt Disney's Donald Duck. There are comics. comics. I didn't know there was comics. I didn't either. Okay, everybody hand me all the comics once you've looked through them. Comics. Uh, how old are these? Oh, Ooh. old Hitler. This has got to be. Nice. All of these look like they're from before he died. It says 1956. That was, wait, wait, wait. When did the park open? When did Disneyland Park That's open? That's one year after Disneyland Park opened. Did you say the park opened in 55? Yeah. Oh no, this one's got a vent. Oh, mm. Walt Disney's Donald Duck. Guess look what? Oh, these are the books. These before the movies came out. Maybe. Oh look, interesting. Vacation time is all too short. Don't lose part in your vacation by having an accident. Be smart, play safe. Don't break your leg with an air mattress, Jessica. Uh. Said that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, so there's some blankets in here. Oh. Dumbo! Water baby circus. That's like, I've never even heard of that. Walt Disney Storybooks. I hope there's not like anything in the pages that we're missing or anything. Okay. Oh, Snow White's friends. I want to see what else is in this treasure chest. Oh, each of these is so unique. Okay, what Looks is like this? Looks like there's just some padding. That looks like just... Like, oh. to protect What's it. That? Okay, Whoa. yeah, that's just padding. What, what are these? 
They're figurines. These look like the small world figurines. Oh, oh, wow. Okay, that's cool. Those are neat. <gasps> Walt? Mickey Look. ears. Maybe there's a clue inside it if you open it up. Oh, let's open it. But there's cool. like, it actually says Walt on it. That's really neat. Do you think these are his, his Mickey, ears? Mickey ears? Like maybe he... What is it? Oh, that's so crazy. What's that? I don't know. What is this? <gasps> to you, the lucky finder of this mystery chest, where our hopes and dreams have come alive, Continue on your quest. Some say that it all started with a little mouse, but if the truth be spoken, start at a tiny house. Tiny house. Begin within my magic land, adventure will abound. But clue by clue, step carefully so Patrick Begora can be found. W E D. Patrick Begora. Walt. Wait. Tiny that house. It could be Walt Disney. What's Walt's middle name? I don't know. Elias? Elias? Is it Walter Elias Disney? Wow. Look at that. W E D. Walter Elias Disney. Do you Disney. think this chest is from Walt Disney? I think it is. It has his initials on the outside Wait. of the chest. Okay. okay. That's really that cool. Crazy. What else Wait, is in here? What's that in here? Whoa. It's full of like treasure from Walt Disney. Whoa. Like real, authentic. These, oh, these okay. things are priceless. Yeah, okay. Everybody, okay. be very <gasps> careful. <gasps> Somebody's head popped off. <laughs> okay, we've got an old, old. I wonder oh, if these mean something. Goodness. If each of these has like a meaning to it. An old Minnie Mouse toy. Doll. Whoa. Doll. Doll. It's definitely changed shape since then. She <laughs> looks like a... Well, so has Donald. Look Whoa, at Donald. Look at what Ellie found. Look at this Whoa, old Donald statue. Oh, there's a key. There's a key. There's a key. <gasps> oh. What's this? It's yeah. under... Oh. oh, wow. Is that an old James found a key. Yeah. Well, James, not a key. This is like hand look painted. Look at what James found. Is that a... Pirates okay, w? whatever you do, don't lose any of these things because each of these things could be very important. Yes, here. Okay. I think I want to hang on to that out, key. Out, we out. might need that. Let, let, let me grab it, Corbin. Yes. Fragile. Okay. Okay, we need a place to put all this stuff. Should we just okay. set it out on the ground right sure. here? Sure. Yeah, let's just okay. set it right here in front of the chest. Wow. This and then. Is like insane. This and this are from Pirates of the Caribbean. What is this? Mm. <laughs> this looks like a cookie Whoa. jar. What yeah. has it got on it? Yeah, it's a cookie oh. jar. Whoa, me and Mickey. And this <laughs> is Mickey and Minnie. It's two-faced. Is that the top for the cookie jar? Oh my goodness. That is so cool. You don't see things like this anymore. <gasps> Did you get these out of there? Oh, whoa, see? whoa, 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 whoa. Look at these little tiny things. Oh. Oh. This has got to be a chest full of like his most prized possessions or something. I wonder if they have any meaning. Like, what if these that note he said made it sound like there was some type of a adventure Mickey. or something? Remember Patrick Mickey. Fedora? Mickey. That is Mickey. Good job. Okay, why Check is there this out. A boat in here? It's it says the Feet's Landing. Or it says it, on it? Yeah, it's yeah, a pirate that means ship. It's Pirates of the Caribbean. Wait. That must uh, say Disneyland it. it we should said. go on to At that Disneyland island. It said that Lafitte's Landing. On I remember the that sign. too. That's right. Lafitte's Landing. We learned about Lafitte last year. Remember? So is this supposed to be something from Pirates of the Caribbean? Or that was built before he died. Yeah, that was one of or the original rides at the park. Galveston. Okay, here's a book. A book. Let's look at okay. that later. More stuff. I cannot believe how full this is. Okay, so there's two things we haven't looked at yet. I this think book. we should do the treasure map now. Should we look at the treasure yeah. map? Yeah. Let's look at the treasure map. Does it have any? This just looks like a. Just looks like a, a map. So wait, 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 wait. Treasury. I can see it through. It says Pirates of the Caribbean on it. Maybe. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, okay, well, can I see? Hmm. Okay. I don't right. see any like 
Maybe we should like look at it from a mirror. Alright, what's in the book? Yeah, just kind of take a look in there. There's drawings! There's his journal. Is that just like a notebook from Walt? Look at that. Started my new job today at a real art studio. Since the war, I can wait. Kansas City is nothing like France, but it sure won't be as. It just looks like it's a book full of notes. Or clues that we have to figure out. Ah. I've seen enough blood. The big city is exciting. I can get a picture for 50 cents at the drugstore cafe. I've been making sandwiches most of the time just to pay the rent. It looks like it's a journal or something. Yeah. It's just kind oh, of... this page is about to fall out, but look at it. <gasps> wow. It's like little sketches of From Walt Disney. Oh my god. How much do you think this thing is all worth? I have no idea. Yeah, Charlie's discovering all sorts of cool things on the back of this book. There was red at the beginning too. At the whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, so we've got a ton of cool stuff here. Um, I want to. Oh, I feel like this is just a journal. It's just full of like timeless. It's, it's a journal yeah. from Walt Disney, so that's something that I don't even... That's really special. Yeah. I want to look at this have again, to read though. read that later. I know. I want to, too, because this so was really interesting. It almost sounded like a clue. Well, the thing is, it talks about this chest. This mystery to chest. the lucky finder of this mystery chest, hopes. where hopes and dreams have come alive, continue on your quest. Some say that it all started with a little mouse, but if the truth be spoken, start at a tiny house. Begin within my magic land. Do you think he's Disneyland. talking about Disneyland? Yes. Adventure will abound, but clue by clue, step carefully so Patrick Begora can be found. Okay, there's clue a couple by things clue. in here. Uh -huh. There's a few things in here that I think we should look up. Okay. Number one, tiny house in Disneyland. Okay. And number two, Patrick Begora. Let's see who that is. Just see what pops up. Okay. okay. Right. I'm starting with Patrick Begora and just seeing what pops up. Okay. Wait, there's a tiny house. <gasps> the little man of Disneyland and his adventure land home. Disney Parks blog. Is that in it's the park? It's next to Indiana Jones. Is that Disneyland? It's next to Indiana Jones. Okay, it We says, should go check it out. The little man and his of Disneyland and his adventure land home. Have you ever noticed the tiny house built into the trunk of a tree uh, in adventure land at Disneyland Park? No way. Many it's guests. Indiana Jones. We should go. Many guests have wondered who its diminutive resident could be. Well, our friends at D23, Disney's official fan club, have the answer. The story of the little man of Disneyland, Patrick Begora. What? Wow. <sighs> Wait, what did it say? It all started with a little, a little mouse, but if the truth be spoken, start at a tiny house. That's the tiny house. It okay. said it's an adventure land. Okay. We should go. Yeah, we're most Okay, of let's the go to Disneyland today. And let's find this tiny house with Kay. Patrick Bogora, his tiny house, I guess. All right. Wait, wait, what is, should we read a little bit more about it? Okay, so it says in 1955, the same year Disneyland opened, the little man of Disneyland, it introduced the leprechaun who lives in a tiny house in the roots of a Disneyland tree. So, Disney, Patrick Bogora is, I guess, a leprechaun who lives in the tiny house at the roots of a tree in Adventureland. So that's where we need to go. That says, that's where it starts. Wow. And then we have to follow clue by clue carefully. Okay. Cool, let's go. That's so exciting. Yeah. Woo. Okay, we gotta make sure this stuff stays safe. And do we need to bring any of this with us, do you think? If we're gonna let's at least bring the notebook. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, all of this stuff... I don't think we could bring it, and I don't think we'll need to. Let's leave it here where it'll be right. safe. Okay. Okay. I think there's more. Yeah, we're gonna go to Disneyland today because we have a clue that we need to follow. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. It's raining. Ah, the park, it's raining. Becca, no. Charlie's in the stroller. I wanna see Charlie. Thanks, Charlie. He's pretty covered. <laughs> It's like drenching rain though. It's it not is like, pouring down it's rain. It's not like a light is 
sprinkle. I was like, oh, it's gonna be like Utah, like a light sprinkle when they say rain. Uh oh. This is like drenching. <laughs> Guys, we made it into the Disneyland park. And but it's it is rainy. so stormy and rainy outside. It's been pouring down. Like, everybody's boring. soaking wet. It's true. But, wow. um, so what are we looking for? So, what food's in, in, in Adventureland, a tiny house near a tree. Yeah, so. In last video, we found we opened the treasure chest from Walt Disney. We figured it out that it yeah. was a chest of treasures that Walt had hidden away, and we found a note. Do we have that note still with us? I took a picture of it on my phone. A picture, and it told us to look for a uh, leprechaun or something. What was his name? Yes. Uh, something. I want to say Zach Galifianakis, but I know that's <laughs> not. <it. laughs> Let's see what it is. We've got all the kids here. James, are you keeping dry? Yeah. Patrick yeah, Bagora. Patrick Bagora. Yeah. It says start in a tiny house and it's by the trunk of a tree. So that's the where trunk we're going to try of a tree. And go. So if it's next to a tree, we're in trouble because there's a lot of trees here, dear. Start like a little mouse. Okay. But if the truth be spoken, start at a tiny house. Begin within my magic land. That's where we are. Adventure will abound. We're in Adventureland. Adventureland. But oh. clue by clue. Is that a clue that we're in a, supposed to go to Adventureland? Yeah, I think so. I didn't even think about that. We just came here to get dry. But Adventure. Adventureland. Oh. But clue by clue, step carefully so Patrick Begora can be found. All right. Kay. Let's start looking at the base of trees. I saw a picture of it online when I was That's researching right. we did see a picture. it. So let's just look at the bottom of these trees around here and see if we can find see it. See if we can get lucky and find that. Yeah. Okay, there's a lot of trees. Let's start looking. I think we should just go... Oh, and look at all the trees that are available for us to look at and make our way all through this area. Okay, let's go. You lead the way, James. Is there anything around these trees? Not there. No? Here's a couple of trees. Let's see about these ones over here. Okay. Here's a big tree, guys. There's some a big tree around here. Did you get an yes. umbrella? Good, we In need it. In order to even film this, we have yeah. to have an umbrella because our camera's really nice. Yeah, I'm getting drips of water on the camera already. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, cool. Okay, let's keep looking for that tree then. Okay. Okay, Becca, we've searched around all these trees nearby, but there's some more trees just down the road, so let's okay. keep going. There's a lot of trees here, dear. Yeah. So when I was looking at the picture, it's not a palm tree. It's a different kind of tree, you know? So that's what we got to look for. Okay. Okay, guys, so we decided it was just two wet and rainy. The rain's coming down really hard, so we decided just to take a break, hoping that maybe the rain will slow down. We're gonna get some food really fast. Check out what we got. This looks really strange to me. It kind of looks like one of those like see-through worm creatures. <laughs> maybe now the only kid I'll eat that I'll eat it is me, because I scared everyone away. That looks good. Can I have some of that? Yeah, have some tiger tail. Okay, once we've had a chance to get some food down, I think we're gonna head back out on the hunt, see if we can find that tree. I'm just hoping that the rain slows down just a little bit so we can get back out there and, and go hunting for this treasure, whatever it is. Is it good? We are sure to fish the bite. <laughs> okay, we are die-hard treasure hunters. Uh, we've sent Ellie and Charlie with the rest of the family to seek shelter. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining cats and dogs out here. It really is. It's so bad. So, Michael and I and James and Corbin have decided, <laughs> rain on my nose, that we're going to keep hunting. <gasps> One Mississippi. One Mississippi. Uh, there's thunder and lightning out here today. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Miles away, that was <laughs> So we're gonna try and keep hunting for the tree and see okay. if we can't find it. Okay, let's keep looking. Tarzan's tree house. Tarzan's tree house. Wow. 
Wow. Let's look around Tarzan's tree. Okay. Okay. Guys, look around the bottom of Tarzan's That's tree. That's the thing I remember. It has like a bunch of roots by it. Spindly roots. Yeah. Okay. I have roots. The other one did. Let's look around the roots. I don't see anything down there. Will you keep moving? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, this is the right idea. Are we getting close? I think this might be it. Keep looking, guys. And get to it. And on the picture, it's like it looked like you could get to it. Okay. So let's keep looking. Let's keep over looking. Here. There's another tree over here. Hey. There's a tree. Where? I want to see it. Oh, is that a chimney? Yeah, that's a chimney. Whoa! And then there's a lamp and a door. And like that window. No way! Look at that door! You guys, check that out. How cool is that? That's, that's the leprechaun's awesome. house. Who, what's his name again? Uh, Patrick. Patrick Bagora. Patrick Bagora. That's Patrick Bagora's house. Wait, wait, wait. Wow. Knock on the door. You want to knock on the door? Okay. Well, well, okay. It was basically a clue. Is there going to be another clue? It said follow the clue, clue by clue or something like that. Corbin's yeah. knocking on the door. I want to get a look and see. Nothing's happening. Hmm. Do you still have that notebook, Becca? I gave it to you. Okay. Let's, let's read the notebook and see if there's any messages or okay. any further insight in there. Okay, we found some shelter in Tarzan's treehouse, but let's pull out that book and see if there's any messages in there. Okay. <laughs> okay, James, listen up. Corbin, come here, listen up. Wow. It's so loud because of the rainstorm. You were reading the beginning before and there wasn't much to it. Is there anything in like the bookmark? Where does that bookmark take us? What does that say? Well, well, I see you have discovered the home of my little friend, Patrick. It says, today I took my sweet girls to Griffith Park merry-go-round. There the park was so bad, my sweet girls didn't feel quite safe. It is my dream to create a place where families can come and all feel safe there. Perhaps I call it Disneyland. I'll be sure to have some, several benches there for parents to keep an eye on the kiddos. Sauna. Benches. Benches. After you've gotten there, so we need to go here first. There's a two here, a one. Look at that. There's a one, that's a two. And then there's a three right here. So maybe we need to go here first. Merry-go-round? Merry-go-round? Yeah, that's over, over by the castle. But there's some underlying words. Dream benches. Dream bench. What is a dream bench? I feel like I remember hearing a story about Disney bringing a bench from a park. Oh yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. In the journal, he was telling the story about how he was at the park with his little girls. Yeah. And they didn't feel safe. And that's where he decided to make Disneyland. Yeah. I've heard that story before. Is there a bench here at the park? Did he Should we ask somebody about a dream bench? Did he bring a bench here? Yeah, from that place. From the merry-go-round? I think I've heard that before. I've heard that story okay. too. Okay, let's go see if we can find something that, that would correlate with that. Okay. okay. Yeah! You guys got all that? Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Let's go. Hi. Well, we're going to Main Street now. Okay. Oh, what did she say? Okay, she said it's inside Mr. Lincoln. Oh. In his body. <laughs> okay, we're on Main Street. Which way okay, to Mr. Lincoln? That way. Okay. 
Okay. I'll follow you then, dude. I think it's on this side. Okay, I'll follow you. Ah, it's raining so bad. James, have you ever been to Mr. Lincoln before? Yeah, well, So you know where it is too? No, not really. Okay, Corbin seems to remember. We'll follow him. Are we almost there, buddy? Yeah. I think we're almost there. I think it's that building straight ahead. Oh, it's raining so bad out here. James is loving it though. I'm slower. You're slow, I'm that's pregnant. okay. But I think we made it. Great moments with Mr. Lincoln. Guys, is this the bench? I think this is it. Whoa. Good job finding it. We found it! The actual park bench from the Griffith Park merry-go-round in Los Angeles where Walt Disney first dreamed of Disneyland. Disneyland. This That's is the dream it. bench. Cool! This is awesome. Okay, so now what do we do? Oh look! It's Pluto! Oh! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> I have to hold this book underneath here. It's so like I it's so rainy terrible outside. Got wet. Yeah. All right. The bookmark. That's where it was. Okay. All right. Let's see. Now we still haven't figured out what this word means down here. Sona. Sona. And it's got quotation marks. Do we have to say something? Hmm. Okay. Oh. We haven't been able to figure this out yet, but. We noticed that there's an interesting story. What page is it on? So, it's on... Page 45. 45. So there's a bunch of dog-eared pages right here. And so we think we want to take a look at that. Because we're not really figuring anything else out besides just looking at the park bench. Right. I mean, yeah, they, he tells a little story, you know. But then there's this word, Sona. Sona. And I just want to make sure that we're not missing something. Because it doesn't make sense to come to this park bench, but there's nothing here. Or nothing. Yeah. To do or find. Um, so let's read that story again. She just read it. It's very interesting. You guys definitely need to hear okay. it. Okay. Our trip to Europe started out rather eventless, but events of the past few days have left me more than a bit spellbound. And I mean that literally. When we dipped our toes across the border from Great Britain into the Green Valley of Ireland, I was shocked that our fame had preceded us. Even out in the countryside, we didn't dare tell a soul about what happened there. But afterwards, our lives would never be the same. It all happened while we were being escorted up to one of the oldest castles on the Emerald Isle. As I was kicking about in the dirt, I dislodged a small rock about the size of my fist, revealing a small tunnel leading under the castle. I knelt down and reached into the crevice and pulled out a golden key. I quietly tucked it into my pocket and, meaning fully to tell our guide about it after our tour, um, yeah, meaning to tell our guide about it after the tour. As I caught up to the group, I suddenly realized that I couldn't see things very clearly. Suddenly, I became dizzy and collapsed onto what can only be described as a dream. Like no other, I found myself unable to move, still in the castle, but surrounded by the wee folk. Wee folk. Wee folk. What is a wee folk? Let's keep reading. Wee folk. Okay. Oddly, they addressed me as Mr. Walt Disney. They said I had stolen the key to the castle and that as long as I knew about them and the key, they were now bound to me and, and I to them. They insisted that I carried what they called the heritage of magic through my Irish lineage. They said I was to keep the key and take another artifact with me back to the U.S. Then they insisted that seven of them come back with me to guide guide the magic. Seven. Oh, I was shocked and more than confused. I had often wondered about the wee folk, but, but always concluded that it was just a lot of blarmy. It's not. When I woke from my dream, I found myself again standing with our group. Within the castle ruins, I thought to myself, well, that was the strangest thing ever. As I reached into my pocket and to my relief, the key was gone. I must be over tired from our trip. I thought so. I thought so. I just went home to our lodging and went straight to bed. Again, the wee folk visited my dreams. And I woke with a start and reached for my reading glasses. But to my surprise, in their place, I found the golden key. Whoa. 
So it was real. It was real. That's crazy. Do you remember this key that we pulled out of the chest? Oh, look over there. Watch out. Oh. It's uh, Donald. Donald. Hi. Found the secret. Cool. Do How's it going? <laughs> Here, let's scoot out of the way. Yeah, you know in this door, there might be someone in there. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Yeah, you messed up. Either here or here. Yes. You want to get a picture? Let's go get a picture. <laughs> There's Minnie. She's running. Things get busy real quick. Rebecca, do you think that this key is the one he was talking about? Maybe we can unlock This is the key that we found in the treasure chest. Do you think it's the same one? Wow. It looks pretty cool. Oh, yeah, that's right. It was gold. That's yeah, not gold, that's silver. silver. Maybe that must be that something key else. Unlocked, like, a little <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> this place is pretty popular. Yeah, look at him. Okay, I'm going to hang on to this because I don't think this is what the book was talking about. But that's a pretty crazy story. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. 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 <laughs> All right. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> Hi. Okay. <laughs> Finally found a place that's a little bit more quiet and secluded. I had something I wanted to tell you guys about. This that was, is crazy. That was so crazy though that we were sitting over there and all of a sudden all those characters showed up out of nowhere. It was like, whoa, whoa, wow. <laughs> okay, but I want to talk about that story that we just read. Yeah. So Walt Disney had an experience where he yeah. saw what he called We Folk. Yeah. Do you think it's the same as the Leprechaun? I do. Patrick Bagora? Okay, why would it... Why would it tell us all that stuff leading up to this clue? Right. Yeah, I think it's definitely a leprechaun. Okay, this is crazy to imagine there's leprechauns that Disney built a house. So the story of Patrick Bagora is he was cutting down the orange groves to build Disneyland and he found a leprechaun yeah. in the park area and the leprechaun wanted to stay here so he built the house for the leprechaun and then he built a whole bunch of houses I guess and he, that story talked about magic and the key. Yep. Um, at the beginning of the book, do you remember what it said on the very front page? These little guys speak in Gaelic. In Gaelic. So what if Gaelic. that means something? Gaelic. The leprechauns speak Gaelic. What if we have to do something Gaelic? Okay. Gaelic, Gaelic. it's a language. Okay, that's in red. It's in red, And yeah. I saw, where did I see some red? It was right on here. the bookmark, yeah. That one and that one. I'm going to look up Gaelic and just... What does Sona mean in Gaelic? Do you think that means something? And maybe we have to say that word. Okay, let's see. We'll say all the words that are marked that are red. Yeah. Gaelic, relating to the Gaelic languages, particularly particularly the Celtic language of Scotland. Okay. So Scotland. Okay. So put Islands in, of Western Scotland. Put in Sona. Ireland. Let's see what it means. Okay, Gaelic. Sona, S O N A. Sona. What does it mean? Sona. From Old Irish Sonus, good fortune, prosperity, and happiness. Happy. Happiness? Happiness. Sona. Yeah, Sona, happiness. Happiness. Yeah, look up this next one now. Falls. B A L B H. A L B H. Dumb. 
<laughs> dumb, mute. Inarticulate, dull. Okay, Happy so. Happy and dumb. Let's see. What's that mean, dumb and happy for Sona? Okay, if you've gotten this far, you're on the right track. It says track. We haven't done okay. anything with track, and that's underlined right okay. here. Okay, yeah. After you sit and dream a while, let off a little steam. steam. And that means dumb. Let off a little steam. Something's so, just not adding up here. Track and steam. So do we need to go to the train? That sounds good. But I think there's still something that we're missing. Do you remember in the story he said seven we folk went with him? Yes. What if those seven we folk represent something? Seven, maybe seven leprechauns? Seven leprechauns? Maybe we folk are leprechauns. Parks? The, the we folk are leprechauns. Seven, okay, so... Well, we've got... Was, how we've, many lands are there? there? We went to Adventureland. That was one land. Um, this one says happy, that one's dumb. <gasps> what? Seven dwarfs. The seven dwarfs. Seven. They're they're we folk. It's Snow White. Dwarves are we small folk. people. The seven dwarfs. Snow White. Snow White and the seven dwarfs. Do you That's think that Sona it. represents okay, if it happy said, the dwarf? If it said happy and dumb. Dumb might be dopey. Dopey and happy. Whoa. Okay, what else is in this book? What else is in here? Okay, so okay. So what if we go back to the bench, the dream bench, and what if we speak Gaelic? What if we say the Gaelic word for happy? Okay. Because see how it's quoted, quoted here? Yeah. Maybe so we have to say that. Let's go back to the bench and say Sona, okay. which is Gaelic for happy, and see what happens. Okay, let's okay. do it. Okay, we're back at the bench. On the count of three, let's say Sona. Not super loud, but just loud enough. One, two, three. Sona. Okay, let's, okay. let's try it one more time. Maybe you... Yeah, I think you've said it right. Let's try it again. Okay. All right. On the count of three. One, two, three. Sona. <gasps> Whoa! Look at that! Whoa! Look at the look at that. That was not there before. What is it? That's happy. That's happy. That's that is happy. Why the seven we were right. It was at the seven doors. Whoa. Let's say the dumb one. After you sit and dream a while, let off a little steam. Bow. Guys, what is, do you think the leprechaun brought this here? Some of Disney's magic made it appear? Wow, and it looks so old. Look at that. That was not here before. That is so cool. Wow, that just appeared. Becca, there's more down here. What's that? What? It just looks like a piece of garbage. See that? Oh. I think this is like a piece to a puzzle. Seriously? Or a piece to something. Look, it has some some words on there. What if by speaking the Gaelic word for happy at the park bench, it invoked the magic of Disney through the leprechauns? I think that's gotta be Wait, maybe we have to say the other word now. It just showed up. Like Do we wanna say Balba here yes. too? Yes. Let's see Bob. if it Maybe it makes Dopey show up. Okay, on the count of three, let's Okay, let's say. try it. Ready? One, One two, three. Balba. Balba. Nothing? Nothing. Let's try again. Let's say it like Balba. 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 Okay, one, two, three. Balba. Balba. Still nothing. Maybe we're supposed to be at the train track. On the right track. Because remember how it said let's track, see. the steam track? Yeah. Have to, yeah. If you, you've gotten this, you're on the right track. track. After you sit and dream a while, let off a little steam. Okay, it's got to be the train. Let's go to the train. It's be the and train. then maybe if we speak this word at the train, maybe then Dopey will show up. Okay, let's do it. Okay, let's, is the train running? Okay. I'll find out for you. Model of a train in there. Let's go up to the train. The train station is just right up here, so let's go see if we can get on it. Okay, we're gonna go to the train station and see if we can find something, but I guess the train's not running right now. The train's not even running. Because of the is, storm. There's so many things shut down right now. I so I don't see the train anywhere. No, they're closed. They're closed? Yeah, 
Yeah. Is the whole the station lighting. closed down, or can we go in there? You can actually, if you slide through here, you can actually get into the. Okay. The so the train station's closed. You want to go the other side, Becca? Okay. Follow mom, guys. There's a treasure chest. That's cool. The whole station's shut down. It's like there's something trying to stop us from moving forward here. Yeah. So close, and yet so far. No. What are we gonna do, dear? Well, why don't we just try it right here? You want, we're at the train station. We're at the train station. If it's magic, it can happen. Then let's do it. Okay, let's do it. Okay. What's the word? Do you remember the word that we have to say? <laughs> okay, let's look it up. Oh wait, not on my phone. It's in the notebook. Let's just say it as loud as we can right here. Okay. And see if it, if something appears. Okay, what's that word again? How is it spelled? B A L B A H or something like that? B A L B H. Okay, B A L B H. Okay, on the count of three, let's all say it at the same time. Okay, you guys ready? What was it? One. Bulb. 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 Okay. One, two, three. Bulb. Look at right that. There. Look at that. What? That was not there before. Whoa. Whoa. It's dopey. It's dumb. That's the one. That's dopey. The one dumb. It's dopey. <laughs> and another, another and another piece of the puzzle. Come on, let's see if we fit together. Okay. Here, let me grab the other one. This is what this one has on it. Okay, and then this one. Does it go right there? <gasps> it fits. It fits. Taste. I have no idea what that. Whoa. That's well, look, cool. Look, it's like a tree on the back. Cool. Two pieces to the puzzle. That means it's working. So found dopey and happy. That's two of the seven. Does that mean that there's five more that we still have to find? I think so. Somewhere here at the park. I think so. Okay. That's so cool, you guys. This is awesome. Okay, so th we're at the train station. Now where do we go, though? Okay, well, the next thing, I guess, I'm not sure. Let's put these where's away happy? where it's safe, though. Okay, I saw Happy. So here's Happy and Dopey. Oh yeah, the first that Disney ever made movie he ever That's made. That's cool. It's interesting to me that it's about dwarves or we folk. Yeah. That's right. And the dwarves are treasure hunters. They, they go mining for oh gold. Goodness. I never even thought about that. I didn't either. That's pretty cool. Whoa. Okay, let's put these under shelter. Okay, all right. I'll hold on to that. Do you still have the notebook? Yes. Okay, let's see if maybe we can get some information out of the notebook that tells us where to go next. Okay. Why does it say 40? So we said so this we just one. we did that. We did this one. I even got it wet. <laughs> what do you think the 40 means, James? Look at that. 40? Yeah. Corbin, I need your help, dude. You can't do it alone. There's a 40 down here on the bottom of this page. Maybe it means... Wait! There is maps of Disneyland, and I think they have numbers on them. Okay. Any other There's ideas? There's just maps just over there. The thing is, this book was written 60 years ago by Disney. Yeah. So the maps of the park right now are not going to be the same anymore. So what else could this 40 mean? Maybe number 40, the page of the notebook. Okay, let's check that. 61. Good thinking, Corbin. 20, 30. Some pages are blank, some pages are not. 40. 40. Oh, yes, that's the right thing, Corbin. Good job, dude. Monstro knows where the wee folk be in a tiny land by the an island sea. Hidden from view till the lights go away after 65 years, then they'll come out to play. Monstro was somewhere. Who's Monstro? We know where Monstro is. It's over there. What it's is straight over there? What is Fantasy Monstro? Land. I've not heard of Monstro before. It's from Pinocchio. Oh, well. you, in that from Pinocchio. That you oh, from Pinocchio. From Pinocchio. Yes. Is Monstro here in the park somewhere? Yes. Monstro's in the little like uh, storybook one. Oh. Like the storybook ride. That's where all the little villages are. If you yeah, if you go riding around, land by an inland sea. tiny land. So they have all the ca the miniature castles. Do you think that those miniature castles were also made for the leprechauns in the park? That would be so interesting if it was and nobody knew it. That's cool. Well, let's wow. go check it out. 
And then it looks Hidden like we have another... Hidden from view till the lights go away after 65 years, then they'll come out to play. 65 years. What year do you think this was? What's 65 years ago? 65, well, 65 years ago. That would have been... That's like the 50s. Wait, the 50s? Or the early 60s. Okay, if it's, then that's, that is when Disney was still alive. That was probably, it's probably been that 65 years by now. Do you think that this is meant to happen right now? Well, okay, here's Because the magic's thing. working right now. Yeah. And we have the treasure chest that came, just, that Mr. E found and gave to us. All right, just at the right time. Just at the right time. So I feel like that's not just a coincidence. Okay. And that we're probably going to be able to find that's so cool. Something that was left here and it's the right timing. Okay, let's go to Monstro. Okay. All right. Becca. Hey, Becca. Look at the ride. You can see the ride behind me. It's right there, but it's closed. It's, it's closed down because of the rainstorm. Okay, well, let me at least show you this over here. Okay, let's go take a look. It's crazy. I can't believe how much it's raining right now. Yeah, my, my socks are soaked already. So this thing that says Storybook Land on it, it yeah. used to be a ticket booth. This used to be a ticket booth? It used to be a ticket booth because they used to sell individual tickets for each ride instead That's cool. of paying one price to go through the whole park. That's really fun. And it looks like it's with a ticket booth for a tiny person. Oh yeah. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Found a mini camera. The button is right here. Right here. Okay, ready? You right here. Here. That one, that one. Here we go. Cheese. Press the button. And there's flash. Hard. There you go. Oh, you took a picture. <laughs> Did you lose a tooth? Yeah. Oh, you're in luck. I think I found it. You found your tooth? No. Is that yours? Oh, no. Oh, I need to find whoever belongs to. Okay, we're definitely in the right place. And you can see Monstro over here. Let's get a close up. We're in the right place. So they said as long as it's raining, this ride is going to be closed just because the boats have no drains, and if they can't drain, then they, we, can't, float. they can't float. So we're not gonna be able to get on the ride. I wonder if there might be another way, kind of like with the train station, if we could still, maybe if we could still do something. What was that word? We should look up and see what it means, maybe. Yeah, I remember, what was it, 40, page 40? I'm gonna use it underneath this poncho. Oh yeah, keep it under the poncho. 40. Can you read it? Cassache. Cassache. Catch. 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 All right, on the count of three, everybody. Say catch, catch. Catch, catch, catch. All together on the count of three. Okay. One, two, three. Catch, catch. catch. Hmm. I wonder if you're saying it right. Catch, catch. Interesting. Hey, let's try this again. A little louder this time, you guys. We got to make sure the leprechauns can hear us. Pronunciation online. One, two, three. Cassica. One more time. One, two, three. Cassica. <gasps> Whoa! Look at that! Oh my gosh! Get it's... it! It's getting wet! Get it before oh, it's soaking wet! Oh, it is wet. Who is it? Which dwarf is that? I don't even know which it's one of them. I think it's Sneezy. Look at the red nose. Uh, or the pink nose. Look! <laughs> He's got a little water pail. It's like he's watering the flowers. Oh, wow, that's funny, right next to the flowers. I want to see it again. I'm putting it underneath here because oh, it's getting all wet. smart. Yeah, it's pouring down rain. I want to see that water pail. That's so cute. Well, I'm glad it worked even though the ride was shut down. Wow. And another piece of the puzzle too. Okay. Cool. Here, let's let me... Let's get this safe. Uh, all right, we need to find the next... Where the next clue is, but let's find some shelter because it's really coming down out here. Where's the place we can go stand? Dumbo Ride's got shelter. Let's go in line and uh, get some shelter over there. Oh no, I'm starting to 
walk and it's like puddles in my feet. I know, me too. All right guys, so we had to hide out in the Red Rose Tavern because the rain was coming down so bad. We were soaking it was wet. So, so bad. And when it's rainy outside and you're pregnant, it's not a very fun experience. So I pretty much felt like <laughs> Eeyore. <laughs> so we got some more food and it looks like the rain is clearing up a little bit. But before we go, we need to figure out where we're going. Well, I was just looking at the last clue okay. that we just were looking at. And it, it, you know how I was like, oh, 65 years. Has it been 65 years? I realized 65 is underlined. The, the number 65. So I have to go to page number 65. Oh, page number 65, just like when you saw 40. You yeah. went to page 40. Now we're going to page That's smart. Yep. Now the luck of the Irish is what you you will need if to this next clue you wish to proceed. The little folk love this and hide it outright in horseshoes and crops when they come out at night. The wee folk love money and magic. You'll see, but the price of a penny is their secret fee. 1901 is the year you must is the year you must find. Esmeralda sees into your mind. That page was underlined. There's an arrow right here. Should you read the other side of the page first? If the wee folk are thirsty, you'd better obey. Get a boot full of gold to take on your way. Now review what you've done. If the drink was all right, hold on to a penny and then make your flight. Gold review. Gold review. What's a gold review? And a boot. Where gold review and a boot and horseshoes. Horseshoes. And okay, the only place that I know of gold boot re gold review boot horseshoes. I think it's the golden the golden horseshoe. horseshoe. Yes. Those are lucky. The they have boots there. Leprechauns are lucky. And okay. So what do we do when we get there? It looks like we've got another word here. Is that the fourth? Boot full of gold to take to take on your way. Now review what you've done. It's the drink. If the drink was all right, hold on to a penny and then make your flight. Okay. Let's go to the golden horseshoe. The golden horseshoe. Okay. Cool. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Woo! Michael's pushing me in my big kid stroller. <laughs> the sun is out. It's starting to get a little bit warmer and it's the rain so has nice. stopped. But and we're still I wearing our ponchos. We're still wearing our ponchos because at any minute at any second it can come, second, back. It can come back. Yeah, we gotta be prepared. Yeah. But my it's feet are all nice. soaking wet. Woo. Anyways, we're heading over to Golden Horseshoe right now. Hey, there's the Golden Horseshoe! Yeah, there it is! Yep, there it is! Right there. That's where we're headed. There it is, we're here! Tell them what you figured out. Okay, so the clue says a boot. There's something about a boot. It says get a boot full of gold to take on your way. It says if the drink was all right, hold on to a penny and then make your flight. So let's go see. If we can, let's get a let's get one of the boots. I think they have some boots here with the ice cream float. Okay, let's try it. Okay, let's do it. Uh, the, let's see the golden horseshoe ice cream float. That comes in a boot, right? Ice cream float. Look at that. Ice cream float inside of a boot. Liquid gold. No fear. Oh, you're gonna spill it. It's on that one side. Okay, let's go. Ah. Oh. Yeah, drink a little bit of it. This is so weird. That is so weird. You drinking out of a boat? Drinking out of an old boat? Here, you want some ice cream? I want a scoop. You want both? Yeah. Okay, let me get you a big scoop of ice cream. Here. Oh. Is that good? I want some. Okay, here you go, James. You guys have been working up an appetite with all this treasure hunting. They just got the done eating lunch. Ice cream actually tastes like the cookie. Is that good? Her beer floats always remind me of my childhood. Is the boot empty? Yeah. Was the drink all right? It was so good. I think it was pretty good. Now, what does the book say? Hold on to a penny and then make your flight. Make your flight. Do you think make your... And then it has a red word. You guys gotta Maybe see Maybe we have to say the red word while we're holding the penny. 
I think you're right, Corbin. So I let's have go back. Idea. Here's the word, Codel. Okay, Becca. Done with my poncho. Do you want to hold the penny? I got a penny right here. And then say the word. The honors. Are you gonna do the honors? Yeah. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Codel. Whoa! Sleepy. It Kodale disappeared. Must, hello. Kodale must be hello. sleepy. Kodale, yeah, that's cool. Hello. Okay, that's I want to cool. get out the other pieces look now that we're in a dry place with the table. Let's you get out the other pieces. You want to look at all of them? Yes. Okay. Look at the no, Okay, I've got the other ones right here. Okay. We've got four now. Yeah. Four of the seven. That means we're more than halfway done. Good job, Corbin. Whoa. What language is that? Good. Yeah, I bet it's the same language, and I bet once we get all the pieces, we can look it up on our phones and it will tell us and what it says. find out what it means. Corbin, any ideas from this book where we need to go next? Where, what page were we on? We are on page 66. Let's go back to this page. There was something else down here. Oh, yeah. There's something else down here. What is that? 1901 is the year you must find. 19, the page. And then it says something about Esmeralda right here. Sees into your mind. You're right. What? It was Down on Main Street. The, your fortune. Remember? Oh. There's a fortune teller. Wait, at the Penny Arcade. And we have, there's a 19 year old, 19 year old penny. A penny is the secret fee. Is there Wait, a we have fee? a penny. Okay, let's go. Okay. Let's go. Cool. We're on Main Street, and just like Corbin said, it's on the Penny Arcade yep. that we're trying to go to because we know that that's where the fortune teller is and her name is Esmeralda. So let's go find her. Penny Arcade! Not yet. Mary Poppins the first. Five times. I know, but... Yeah. Oh, you can see it. Okay. You see the Penny Arcade? Oh, yeah. There's the Penny Arcade. If you look really close, you might have to zoom in. It says 1901. <gasps> that's the year that Walt Disney was born. Wow! That's the significance. That's Esmeralda, the fortune teller. Wow, there's Esmeralda. There she is. So is there something we need to doing. say to activate her? 25 cents. Oh, just have to pay, huh? What page were we on? I don't see any magic word to say here. We need one dollar. says, we folk love money and magic. You'll see, but the price of a penny is their secret fee. 1901 is the year you must find Esmeralda, Esmeralda sees into your mind. All right, let's try this. So maybe we just put in the quarter. Okay. It says they love money. Let's do it. Hey, I'm putting in the quarter. Here we go. She's moving. Oh, wow. She's saying something, anything? I don't hear anything. Whoa! Okay, Esmeralda sees all. That's what it says. And on the back it says, A magic cityscape may unfold before you today. Your adventures could have their downs and ups, and may let you hoist a secret flag, or take part in a spirited adventure. Magic numbers. 30, 30. Oh, this one's highlighted. 30. Go to page 30. Really? Yeah. You think? Try page 30. That'd be weird. 30? That's so weird. Okay, I just got page 30. There's some notes here. Let's see if it tells us where to go next. A secret light that will burn forever, keeping all of your dreams alive. Lights the flames of imagination. Remembering all the days gone by, the magic still glows in an upper window. A place that holds the memories of old. It must never go out or the spell will be broken. And the seven will leave as the legends foretold. Ten crap. Wait, what does that say? Wishing you well. Wishing you well on your journey. Walt, you are such a gem. Whoa. It's like, looks like someone signed his book. Wow. Well, we need to find a light. We're looking for light in windows. And we're guessing it's on Main Street because there's so many different windows here. Okay, I just looked at the book again and it says that the light 
is in the upper window, the flame of imagination. So I don't know if it's gonna be around here or not, but let's just keep looking and see if maybe we can see something here. Okay. Oh, look at the bubbles sticking to the ground. It's just all stuck. Rainbow bubbles leading us along. <laughs> a light! Look at that! One single light above the fire department. It's like a lamp, like a little One uh, lamp. lantern or uh, oil lamp. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. So I think that's it. It's got another word that we need to say, Contact. maybe. Can can cry. Can cry. So do we want to say that here by the lamp? Yeah, let's do it. Come cry. Let's go look. Look around. Let's get a little closer. Oh, I bet it's going to be over there. All right, let's get real close. Look around. Tell me if you see anything. Oh, look. Oh, right there! Whoa! Oh. <gasps> that just, that must have just appeared there. Whoa! Which one is wow. this? We didn't even look up the meaning of that word. It must be grumpy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's grumpy! And another note here. Wow! Okay, cool! Let's keep going. Let's keep finding well, more. What's next? So we found the secret light that will burn forever, keeping all your dreams alive. Okay. Let's see. And we said this. Yeah, and we found Grumpy. Wishing you well on the, your journey while you are such a gem. Wishing well. Wishing well. Oh. Got it. Go there. We know where that is. Yes, right by the castle. Okay, let's go. Okay, we're headed towards the castle, but that's the castle right there. Right next to the castle is where the wishing well is, but right now the castle's being remodeled so we can barely see it. It's all covered up. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is crazy, but that's supposed to be the castle right there, and this is all being remodeled. I almost want to peek through. There's all the seven dwarfs we found Whoa. them all! <laughs> Check it out. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. We we're finding all the dwarves, and there's all the dwarves. <laughs> and there's okay. the wishing well. Your wishes will help children everywhere. Then every single dwarf would appear in front of every other dwarf. They're yeah. all here. We're still missing a couple though. Only two. Two more. Which ones are we missing? I don't know. We got Sleepy Joe Bashful. We don't have Bashful yet. I don't think we yet. have Bashful. Or Doc. Or Doc. Bashful and Doc, those are, because we have five out of the seven now. Yeah. Okay. Let's see, here, I got the book. Let's see what's the next thing we have All to right. do here. Okay, um, page 30. Okay, wishing you well on your journey, Walt. You are such a gem. What's the next page? Gem. Oh! Okay, this sing is... this. Sing this to reveal the magic. We dig, 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 dig in a uh, mine the whole day through. We dig, 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 we dig, dig, dig. That's all we ever do. These guys aren't kidding. Just one more way to make you do their bidding. At least the magic is real. Okay, sing it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, so what happens when they sing it though? Let's find out. Sing this to reveal the magic. Sing this to reveal the magic. <laughs> Not that far. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's sing it. That's all we ever do. These guys aren't kidding. It's just one more way to make me do their bidding. At least the magic is real. I don't think you're supposed to sing the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> just sing the magic spell. <laughs> we dig, 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 dig. Wait, we dig, 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 we dig, dig, dig in a mind the whole day through. We dig, 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 we dig, dig. That's all we ever do. Okay. Is there anything around? I don't see anything. Did you hear some magic? I just heard a magic spell. 
What does it say? Don't get a big head, or you might end up like shrunken Ned. Honestly, is that Don't all it says? Don't get a big head, or you might end up like shrunken Ned. Who's shrunken Ned? Shrunken Ned. Is that the magic that revealed? Shrunken Ned. Oh, wait. Look. I just realized something. Do you remember when we were in Adventureland earlier? When we were looking for the leprechaun's house, we were eating at that restaurant. We took a break because it was raining. We were eating at a restaurant and I remember seeing kind of like a booth, almost it looked like Esmeralda, and it had a head. A shrunken head. Really? Yeah, remember the headhunters? It's only a shrunken head. Did you see it too? I remember What's seeing it on the, um, they have it on the, the jungle cruise, the shrunken heads. Oh. But they also have a shrunken head oh. booth in the restaurant. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, cool. Let's go check it out. You guys ready to go? Yeah. Who knows how to get there? Me, okay. I, do, I really do. Okay, lead the way. I just <laughs> We're getting close. Back to where we were when the rain started. Oh, is it in here? I think so. Ooh. Oh, that's coconuts in there, right? There it is. <gasps> I've never even noticed that before. We were literally eating right next to it this whole time. Oh, <gasps> wow. Look at that. Look at his name. Shrunken head. Head shrink of the jungle. For a personal diagnosis and a souvenir prescription card, please insert coins below. Okay. Uh -huh. And they've got a place for your hand. Corbin, do you want to do it? Oh. You want to do the one? You want to do the honors, Corbin? This one takes 50 cents. I've got 50 cents here. Okay. So Corbin's gonna do it. All you right. want me to put the money in for you or you wanna put the money in? Okay, just put one at a time. What? What? What are you doing here? Your appointment's for tomorrow! Good heavens, the very idea! Don't you know that today is my golf day? What do you think so? I know that all doctors are supposed to play golf, but in my case, the, the other doctors use my head for the ball. <laughs> well, they'll come back tomorrow and we'll see about those myriad festering diseases you've obviously acquired. <laughs> Until then, take me by tender burrow and thank you so much for patronizing Shrunken Ned on the wrong day. The jungle's only self-service witch doctor. <laughs> Buy a calendar, man. <laughs> Check it out! It spat out a card. It's got a message on it. What's on the bottom? Shrunken Ned. Three wishes here, but only three. This Darby. Darby O'Gill? Oh! Duchess of Disneyland is beautiful. She got you in the palm of her hand. Three wishes here, but only three. Just ask Darby. Three wishes. Duchess of Disneyland. So, what is the Duchess of Disneyland? The Duchess of Disneyland. Anyway. Beautiful. She's got you in the palm of her hand. Three wishes here, but only three. Just ask Darby. Three wishes. Have you seen Darby O'Gill? Yes. Does that have anything to do with witches? I can't remember. Or witches? It's been such a long time. <laughs> okay. Should we look it up? Okay. okay guys, so we looked up the Duchess of Disneyland and I guess there's a story about a palm tree that was here. A palm tree that was left here from before the park was built. Yeah. Or it was brought here? Was it brought here? It's like a really, really, really old, old, old palm tree. And I think it's actually close by. Have you heard the story about the palm tree? Let's go check out the palm tree. And I guess we get to make three wishes with the palm tree. Three wishes. But only three. But Just only three. Darby. So I guess in Darby O'Gill, if you make four wishes, then you lose all your other three wishes. So we only get three wishes. So let's go find the Duchess of Disneyland. Go check it out and make some wishes. Okay. And then see where to go from there. That's it right there. Let's get closer. You can see it behind the other trees right there. That's the Duchess of Disneyland. 
It's the palm tree that was here before the park was. And they've left it here and built the buildings around it. That's cool. This tree is way older than we are. All combined. We get three wishes, apparently. Should we make three wishes then? Sure. I wish that I had triple scoop ice cream. I wish that I could have a candy that there could be a little bits of them and a lot of little bits of them. <laughs> Becca, what do you wish for, baby? A new house. You wish for a new house? <laughs> and I wish for Wait, a million four. dollars. Stop, that's four. Oh, I ruined it. Sorry, I just got so excited. Everyone else was making wishes, and I wanted to make a wish too. Oh, no, we don't get any <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking. I just got so excited. Everybody else was wishing for stuff. I figured, hey, you guys are wishing for candy and ice cream. I wanted a million dollars. Then I could buy everything, and I just ruined it. I'm sorry, guys. Wow. Oh, no, I feel bad that's now. Okay. I'm really well, sorry. Let's get it. Dang it. Oh, 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 and now I get it. After reading it again, the Duchess of Disneyland is beautiful. She's got you in the palm of her hand. She's a palm tree. Yeah. <laughs> three wishes here, but only three. Oh, three. Only three. Okay, I'm but sorry, you guys. What? I thought it was three each. So it's kind of like side. Like, where? what about finding the seven horse? Is there anything else on that note? Maybe each. Well, I don't think so because none of the wishes came true. I think I blew it for everybody. I don't see anything else. Oh, there's a number written right here that oh. I didn't notice before. 1001. Okay, let's look in this book and see if there's anything. 1001, there's, yeah. Is there a thousand pages in that book? Yeah, or a hundred. There's only like 200 pages. Wait, oh, oh I saw God. a thousand and one. I saw a thousand and one. Oh, look at that. One, <laughs> it's got a hundred and then a thousand and one. Someone made it, an edit here. It all started with a mouse and we were great partners. But if it only took two, I wouldn't need ten to stand by and imitate all my little friends. What statue? Um, Walt Disney with Mickey Mouse. Oh, that statue's called Partners. Oh, really? Yeah. They promised me if I did everything I, they asked, they'd show me the source of the treasure. I know it, I'm getting close to have to admit these seven little guys have become my best friends these past five years. Okay. I bet five is where the next one's at. Wait, seven is underlined and five is underlined. Page 75? Maybe. Okay, well, let's We need to go to partners first. first. Partners. And what's that word? And we need to. So. Fetish. Fetish. So, what do we do when we get to partners? Do we just say that word? I think so. Let's, let's do it. Okay, let's go. Okay. Check it out. We're almost there. Partners. I didn't know this was called Partners. Let's look, there's a plaque. Why not, right here? Barbara? Yeah, look at that plaque. Partners. Right, right front there, you see it? That says that Partners. I think most of all, what I want Disneyland to be is a happy place where parents and children can have fun together, Walt Disney. Cool. And now we gotta read the word in front of the sign. Fay teach. You guys all got that? You guys can help me say it? Yeah. One, two, three. Fay teach. Maybe we try again? We need to look around. Or do we want to look around for a minute? Hmm. I don't see anything. Okay. Let's look at that page one more time and see if maybe we missed something here. Okay. It all started with a mouse and we were great partners. But if it only took two, I wouldn't need 10 to stand by and imitate all my little friends. 10 to imitate all my little friends. Look, there's little statues around. Where? One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Whoa, there are, look at that. 
There's a whole bunch of statues. There's a, there's ten of these, huh? So ten statues imitate. Do we need to imitate all of the statues? Can you imitate that? <laughs> That's perfect. You guys, help me pose in this shape. Okay, you guys, exactly help doing. mom pose. So I think we need to pose. He's not picking his nose. He is. No, he's just putting his finger in his mouth. There's his nose. Not right there. <laughs> Corbin, you got it? Other hand, Corbin. There you go. All right, let's go to the next one. That was number one. He's holding something in this hand. His hand is pointing out this way. He's going. Good job, guys. Next one. That was number two. Okay. Okay, pose him. We have shaking hands. James, stick his leg up in the air. And Corbin. There we go. Good job, guys. I think we got it. Next one. Number four. Okay, number five, let's go. <laughs> Is this a girls only one? Girls only. <laughs> Good job. Your butt right here on the bottom. We got Pinocchio and someone's sitting on a foot. Okay, so James is Pinocchio. Corbin, are you gonna be Jiminy Cricket? Okay, sit on his foot. There you go. Now you gotta sit right there on his foot, but be gentle. Corbin won't do it. Becca, will you sit on his foot? <laughs> there we go. Okay. Got it. Good job, guys. <laughs> there they are, you got it! <laughs> okay. <laughs> number seven's done, number eight's over here. Who can make the happy Pluto face? Aha, puppy! You have to get down on three legs, three hands, there you go. Corbin, put that left hand on the ground, no, the other one. There, there you go. That's the shot, okay. That's eight, now we got Walt and Nikki. Okay, let's but see Walt really and Nikki. Only one statue. Okay. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Say teach. Say teach. Okay, look around. Okay. What's up? Look. Oh. <gasps> there it is. It's right there. Bashful. <gasps> and another clue. Okay, let's move out of the way so other people can take pictures. Okay, cool. We got it. We did it. We got it. There's one more. Okay. We got bashful. That means we only have one more to go. Oh my goodness. Okay, we gotta figure out where to go next. Okay. So, I have to admit, these 70, seven little guys have become my best friends these past five years. So, Becca, you noticed earlier the seven and the five are underlined. Yes. So, we want to go to page 75? Try back. Okay. Oh, uh, there's something here. Okay, it says, sailed the seas. Doctor! Sorry, I just had to, I skipped ahead. <laughs> It says doctor, kind of. Oh, it does. And that's the only one that we're missing, Doc, right? That's yeah. the last one we need. Okay, he sailed the seas and saved the nation with a mark of privateer, hoarding loot in hidden chambers anchored by landing there. Doctor. 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 Anchored by. Anchor? Lafitte's Landing. Where's that at? What anchor? John Lafitte's anchor oh, that was on his ship. anchor! Oh yeah! So, do you guys remember in the treasure chest? There was a pirate ship and it said Lafitte's Landing. Yeah. And he was a privateer. Let's go see. Where's the anchor at? Do you guys know? Yeah, it's it's just right next to the water. Okay, let's okay, go. Yeah, let's go. And then we have to say doctor. And that's in Adventureland, yeah, right? Adventure. Yeah. Look at that, it's going. And we're walking right along with it. Hey, there's Pirates of the Caribbean. I think we're close, aren't we? Yeah. Do you guys know where the anchor is? This way. Okay, okay. show me, James. No, it's down there. Okay, let's go. There's the anchor. 
The feet anchor. Check it out. It said to be from a pioneer ship commanded by commanded by John the Feet. It is also said that Lafitte private steering ships that left a wake of blood from the mainland of Tuvaturila Bay, but don't believe everything you read. <laughs> wow. Okay, what's the one we're supposed to say now? I think you remember it. Oh, Doctor Peter, Doctor something. Was it Doctor? Yeah. Make sure you're pronouncing it right, because this is Gaelic, not English. We need to say it right. Ready? You should try saying it with like a Irish accent or something. I can't even think of what Irish sounds like right now. Ahoy, me me Sorry, that's pirate. <laughs> uh, doctor. Doctor. Do doctor. <laughs> Does that sound right? Doctor. You try saying it, Corbin. Doctor. Say it like, Doctor. say it with an accent. Doctor. Okay, that's baby Doctor. language. Okay. <laughs> this is hard. Doctor. It, it All of you say it at the same time. Okay, let's look at the book. Let's see if we can... Doctor. See? Doctor. Who's right? Okay, let's say it together. Ready? Like this. One. Two, three. Doctor. Hey! Whoa! It's the last piece. The last piece. Oh my God! We found it. We found it. Wow! Cool. That's awesome. Okay, let's go find a table and put all the pieces together. We've got all seven dwarves now. Wow! Okay, let's go find it. You want to find a table and set them all up? Okay. So we've got all the dwarves Rumpy, here. Dopey, bashful, I think. That's bashful, yeah. Sleepy, sleepy, happy, happy, happy. And, and sneezy. sneezy. Okay, and then here Let's are get all the papers together. All the papers. Let's see. Oh, I'm excited. We got all of it. Okay, we got Corbin and James on the job. Mom's helping to organize all the, the pieces of the puzzle here. There you go, that's the way. Okay. Oh, you knocked over Sleepy. He's Sleepy, that's why he's <laughs> <laughs> fell. Asleep. He keeps falling asleep and passing out. <laughs> Okay. Oh wait, I think this one. Or this one. Okay. Yeah. And then this goes right here. Yeah. Oh. Corbin, that goes right here. There we go. We got all the pieces. Okay, not. Hey, I'm gonna look it up. Seal. Okay, yeah, look that up. That's interesting. I wonder what. Oh, I want to know what it says. You guys, this has been the most amazing treasure hunt ever. This is so cool. I can't wait to figure out what it says. Did you figure it out? Ready? Okay. Go to hit search. Are you searching up all of them? Yes. Okay. Let's see. Uncover. Okay. Knocked. That's knocked. Maybe just try one word at a time. Maybe. Oh wait, no, it said forest and woodland. So bear woodlands. Hey, the train's running now. Hey, running! <laughs> Kid with So not means naked. Or bear. Or bear. Bear okay. naked? Like uncovered? Let's look up the next word now. Uncovered. Bear. What's what's the next word? C E I I L T E. L T E. Hidden. So hidden. bear, like make uncover hidden? Uncover. Or naked. Yeah, okay, and what's the last word? T A I 
Okay. T A I S C E. Deposit. Uncover hidden deposit. Deposit. What do you think deposit Wait, means? Maybe. Money. So if a deposit is money, could it mean treasure? Whoa. Treasure? Where what though? Is that? But where do we go? We have all the seven dwarfs. We have all the seven dwarfs. And we have the final. The book. The book is the only thing else that we have that we should look at. Okay, yeah, let's look at the book. See if it tells us where else to go. Okay. Okay. 21. Anchored by Ellen. 21. 21. We okay, didn't one? look at 21. 21 is just like. That's like more near the beginning where he just yeah. had a whole bunch of journal entries. 21. Today I created a cute little guy named Mickey Mouse. We were on a train ride and Lillian insisted that Mortimer was a horrible name. <laughs> just too stuffy. I think she's right. Mickey is just so much more friendly and I have an idea that just might save the studio. I've just got to convince Roy to pick up sound, synchronized sound to our animation. That's the future. <gasps> it has a number underneath it, 133. Oh, 133? Okay, we gotta go find 133. So why would it take us to page 21 only to have us turn around and go back to page 33? There's gotta be something that's important. What's on page 133? Oh! In a secret hidden doorway marked by steps of 21. 21. Pirates watch the games and graves, graves and treasures, so the crowds can have their fun. There are one weathered age gold pirate. Hold up the map. The others. Dread. Dread. If you'll open mm, Magic's doorway. Magic's doorway. Now they have your fortune red. Now they have your fortune red. Well, the map. Well, should we go to the secret hidden, secret hidden doorway marked by steps of twenty-one? Secret hidden doorway marked by steps of twenty-one. Okay, I know in the Louisiana, New Orleans, area, New Orleans area. Okay, they have numbers above the doors oh. in the whole area there, like almost like addresses. Oh, okay. I think we should head there and see if we can find the number twenty-one. Let's do it. Yeah, that's a great idea. Okay, let's gather all this up. Make sure to follow us on Instagram. You'll get ahead of time clues for what we're doing in the video. At Beach House Blogs. Check it out. Here are all of the seven dwarfs that we've collected throughout the day today. Twenty-one stairs or it was near some yeah, stairs it was maybe? Twenty-one steps. Twenty-one steps. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wait, is it that? I see a staircase over there. Okay, let's go look around let's there. Let's go see. Look, Becca. 24. Do you see above that door? It says 24 and that one says 20. <gasps> oh, right up there. Oh, let's see. That one says 24, 24 and then that one says 20. So I think we're looking for 21, right? Yes. There's 23 and I see 17 also. Whoa. To the left, look. Oh. 17. Oh, 17 right there. And that one says 23. 23. So we're looking for 21. Okay, 21. In a secret hidden doorway marked by steps of 21. Pirates watch the graves and treasures so the crowds can have their fun. There, one weathered age old pirate holds a map the others dread. If you'll open Magic's doorway, now then have your fortune read. It's it's not it says it's red, not, not red. Not red. Oh, like the color red. The color red, not red, as in green. Yeah. Okay, let's keep looking let's for number looking 21. For 20. 24 Royal Street, 20 Royal Street. 21. Where? 21 Royal. Right there. 21. Okay, let's go in here. The Royal Courtyard, it says. Look right here. The Royal Courtyard. <gasps> Fortune Red! Oh.
21 Royal. Are these 21 steps? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It is, exactly. 21 steps. Oh, yeah. We found it. This has to be it. Okay, oh, let's read the clue again. Okay. And look, Becca. This is Haunted Mansion, so it's all the dead. And here's Pirates of the Caribbean, it's all the treasure. So it's the, the dead and the treasures. That's what the clue oh. said. Remember the clue? Pirate Red or... Pirates, Pirates watch, watch the graves and, and treasures. treasures. We are in the right place for sure. So crowds can have their fun. Okay, there one weathered age old pirate holds a map, others dread. Right over here. Okay. I think this is the pirate. Look. Holds a map. Fortune He's holding red. a map. And look, Fortune Red. And right here it says, now the, now have your fortune read. Okay, we're at the right place for sure. Okay, should I put okay, a quarter in there? Okay, let's do it, there? yes. <laughs> okay, I'll try two quarters and maybe it'll work. I've seen everybody it's do a, it. It's a greedy pirate. Yep. Okay. It's working! There we go. Look at the map. Whoa. It's map. lighting up. <gasps> is it really? The map is lighting no up. No way! Is that like the path we have to follow? What if we need that? Watch out, land here. Oh. It just spat out a card. Okay, what does it say? 1760. Fortune Red has this to say. Oh look, some of the words are underlined. But lay to media for your zeal sails you plumb out of the blue round of the sea. Out of the blue sea. Look at these words that are underlined. Okay. And look, numbers. 1764 and out of the blue sea. Is that what it said was underlined? Yeah, uh, out <laughs> of the blue sea. Sea. And then look, on this side it's got a pirate ship and an island. Oh. And wait, is that? Wait, I know where it is. Where? It's over on Time Sawyer's Island. There's boats that you can get on to go on top. And it's an island. Do you this is the map of the Treasure Island? That actually oh. does look like Tom it Sawyer's does Island. Look like that island. Okay. Let's go to where that Tom is. Tom Sawyer's Island. Cool. Let's go. Let's do it. Tom Sawyer's Island, here we come. Woohoo! Oh man. Guys. We just missed it, check it out. The boat just barely left the dock. And it's heading over to the island. It's about to come back, I'm pretty sure. Okay, will or it come back? Yeah. Okay, we'll just have to wait here for a few minutes for it to come back. So let's just wait here for a minute and uh, the little ship will come back out here, I guess. So we'll wait. Let's find a place to sit down or something while we wait. I wonder if there's anything else in here. Cause this leads us to Fortune Red. But after the clue from Fortune Red, all we have now to go on is the map. No, no, the, the map 17, there was a number on that card. 1764? No, the page, 1764. Let's see if there's one that says 1764 on is it. Is there 17? That would be all the way at the back, wouldn't it? <gasps> what? What the? What? Promise to keep the secret in the family. This information is just too sensitive. It says Roy has promised to keep this secret in the family. Yeah, Looks like there's cool. another note here. <gasps> kind of hidden in the back. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna read this. Okay. Okay. After I, I got can't believe we found that. Yeah, that's crazy. That's so crazy. After I got home from Europe, I tried to tell Roy about my seven little friends. He thought that I was completely loony until the money started rolling in and the real magic began to happen. I thought that Roy was convinced and believed me, but then he brought in Dr. Black to evaluate me, my mental stability. I was so concerned, concerned and tried to explain the whole thing to them. It didn't work and they were about to have me put away. They said that it was for my own good, just a little vacation. I knew exactly what they meant by little vacation. It would be nothing of the sort. Finally, to my great relief, Patrick showed himself to Roy. Whoa. Patrick Bagora, the leprechaun, showed himself to Roy. Whoa. Patrick showed himself to Roy. I thought that would be the end of it, but Dr. Black was relentless. At first, he was determined to lock me up, 
Then something changed his mind, and his passion became finding the source of my power within my magic empire. His men have been tagging us day and night since then. I've created this elaborate set of clues to hopefully carry on the magic after we are gone. Whoa. Somebody good has to know about my seven friends and take care of their secret. Whoa. Okay, so that means with the hidden note that we just found from Walt Disney, that people are chasing him or were chasing him when he was alive to figure out the source of his power. The magic. The magic. Which is the leprechauns, the little people. And yeah. we've been following them and the magic this whole time. But that, that doctor has people that are looking for that and that are chasing people that know about it. Do you think they could be coming after us? I don't know. Let's get to the island. Okay, let's go. Okay, Boat's let's right go. Here. Boat's back, let's go. Okay, we're on the boat, time to go. Ready to go to the Maybe island? The Ready to go down to the island right now. I got a picture of that map, right? From uh, the red? On the camera, yeah. Okay. Cool. It's really nice that the sun's finally come out. It was so rainy earlier today. Whoa! Look over there. Who is that? Do you think that nobody was looking right at this? Orange. That that's who was chasing like the same organization. Do you? Where did he go? He's coming after us. Let's get off. Let's get on the island and see if we can just get somewhere safe. It's... Yeah, he's still there. He's watching us right now. He's getting on the second march. Like one. Uh oh. He, I think he really might be coming after us. Okay, let's get somewhere safe. Okay. Red Yeah, I still see him. James and Corbin, you guys see that guy? He's got glasses on, and he's got a, a hat yeah. with Mickey ears. Yeah, he's right there. He's getting on the next barge over here. He looks just so suspicious. Like, either he works for the park, and we've just never seen anybody like with that uniform. But the thing is, he was looking right at us, and that was right after we got the note discovering that somebody's been chasing. Somebody was chasing Disney because they found out about the magic. Do you think that that might be one of the guys that knows about the magic and maybe they're after us because they know that we're onto it? I don't know, but we better be safe than sorry. Let's go hide. Okay. Oh, look, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. We gotta hide. Let's go. Are you guys hiding? We're back. We are hiding from someone we think might be chasing after us here on Tom Story Island at Disney. We've been finding all these clues and revealing the magic of Disney's magic. You guys, this is real. There's been someone chasing after us and he is dressed like some type of a Secret Service security guy. He's coming. He's coming now. I saw him. He's coming. Oh, no. Stay down. Did you see him? Yeah, he just walked right past us. I think we better hide in that cave right behind us. There's a cave? Yeah. yeah, let's go hide in that cave. Go to that cave, guys. Go, go, go. He's right there. Go, go, go. Yeah. Okay. I think we I think we lost him. He went What the? Oh, no. Okay. Everybody hide on the side of the rocks. He's right over there. Oh no. Where are we gonna go? Is he over there still? I think he knows though that he missed us. Go in here, go in here. Dead man's grotto, go in there. I don't know, but come on guys, you gotta get out of the light. It's really dark in here. Turn on the light. 
can't see anything. Go, go, go. I think he's right behind me, guys. I'm gonna hide, hide, hide. hide. Shh. Yeah, they're walking this way. I think I've lost him. Did you see him? I think he's coming around the corner. Hide. Yeah, no. I'm looking for him. I think I saw me. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Where did mom go? Hello. Where is she? There she is. Oh. Mom, mom, come did on. Did you find a way out? Yes. I think he saw me. Where? Is he out here? Uh oh. Yeah, I see him. Yeah. I think he saw me. Okay. He found a way out? Way. Let's go. Okay, let's go. This way, guys. This way. Follow mom, guys. Follow mom. Guys, what are we actually even looking for here? I don't remember. The chest is over there. What chest? Oh, yeah, it seemed like it was at the front of the island. We need to look at the map, remember? Okay. The map had a trail and we follow the trail and it will lead us to the treasure. But that magic spell we have to save to reveal the hidden treasure. Do you remember that spell? That's right. But first, I have to. I feel like we have to get undercover to even talk about this stuff because he's right around the corner. Okay, where do we go? Let's go over here. We want to go in another cave? He just walked right past us. Are you okay? I don't think he saw us. I think we've got a minute of protection in here. We found a pretty secluded cave, so what's the plan? What are we looking for? Okay. Well, what was the main reason we came over here in the first place? Before we found out we were being followed. So we are looking for a chest, but it's hidden. Remember, we have to use this magic word. I know where the, it is. It's near the front of the island. Because I looked at the map from Captain Red or whatever, and it led to oh, the Oh, Fortune Red? Yeah, Fortune Red. Because there was that map. Yeah, and I remember it went over there. What if we try to shake him and go up by the path just along here and go straight up into the trees where he might not find us, and then we'll go right to where I need to go. Okay, look, do you know where that is then? Yeah. All right, I'll follow you. Let's go. Is there a way in over here? Whoa! Whoa! What's this? I wonder what Wait, that is. That's, that is skeleton symbols. Skeleton symbols. Yeah. You know what those are? Bubbles. I wonder what it means. Oh wow! A decoy. It must be a decoy. It's, it's way too obvious. Let's keep looking, guys. Is it up here? Yeah. Okay. Corbin, come on. Stay close, buddy. I think I saw him out there. Really? Where was he? He was right over there. Right I'm gonna here. I'm gonna see if I can see him. Okay. Oh, he's still looking. Let's keep going. Okay. Ah! You okay? Yeah. Okay. What is that? It's a telescope. You see telescope? Him? Yeah. You want Oh, that's interesting. 
You can see the rest of the theme park from here. How are we gonna figure out where this hidden treasure is? James, are you still following this map? Are we still on the right trail here? All right, we'll keep following now. Let's go. Okay, guys. We found this kind of hiding nook here. We've been following the path as James has been leading us, but I think I just saw... Let me call him. Who is it? I don't even know who it is. A Secret Service? Yeah, yeah, Mouse? Yeah. He, he looks like he's... I don't know if he's part of Disneyland or if he's just trying to blend in as a fan of Disney. I don't know. I don't Let's, know what it is. There's kind of a spyglass here. I'm going to look through it and see if we can see him. Yep. I see him, guys. Mm -hmm. I can see him through the spyglass. He's talking to somebody. He, he, I think he's got an earpiece and he's talking on his earpiece. Oh my goodness, that's so scary. Okay. The thing is, I haven't seen him with any other Disney employee. He must be communicating to somebody that, they, that he's found us, but maybe he lost us. He seemed a little bit panicked. Let's yeah. keep going. Okay. okay. We gotta go down here. I thought this was the way, but we gotta go down and then go. Oh, we need to go up that path over there? Yeah. Okay, I guess we went the wrong way for a minute here. Can we get back down through here? I hope I but we can fit in here. Kind of a tight hole. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh. You guys. I can't even fit through this hole. Just too wide. Oh my gosh. This is not a place to be claustrophobic at all. It is so tight. The cave. Of wonder. The cave. Remember when you made over here? Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. It's like there's people everywhere, but they have no idea about what's going on around us. Right now. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
This might be it. I think this is where it's at on the map. Somewhere around here. Remember this treasure is hidden, so it's not gonna look like your typical hiding spot for a treasure. Okay, there's this big fort here. I wonder, Becca, if this fort has always been here. Like, what if they built this fort on top of where the treasure is supposed to be? I don't know. Does that make sense? Maybe we have to say the magic word. Is this the right place? Should we say it here? Let's try. Okay. If you're following the map, this is definitely the place where I feel like it should be based on where the X was on the map. So maybe maybe we need to stay right around here. Oh wait, check this out. Look at this. Does that look like an X to you guys? That kind of looks like an X. What do you think, Becca? Do you see it? Well, it looks like a giant. Yeah, it looks like an X. Maybe this is the place. Should we say the magic words? Yeah. Okay, you still have it on your phone, Becca? You took a picture of the magic words. So, do you have the, the magic spell? Yeah, you took a picture of it, I remember. Okay, so. Knocked. So, let's say it one at a time. Okay. One, two, three. Knocked. Knocked. One, two, three. So, eat. Taste. One, two, three. Taste. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Becca, I think we need to say it all at the same time. Like like a sentence, okay. not as individual words. In our last video, we dec decoded what it means. It means cover uh, hidden stats, like deposit or something like that. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. uncover hidden deposit. Okay, but we need to just say it all at the same time, I think. It needs to be like a like a phrase, like a sentence. Knocked, sealed in, taste. Whoa! Oh my goodness, you guys. Whoa. This is it. Oh no. <gasps> Whoa. So cool. Look at the gems. That's a gold key. Is it a key? There is a key. Oh, it's right underneath all the gems. Oh! <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Another key, look! And look at this. Guys, I've got the other key right here. Look, now we have two. Two keys. Oh my goodness. What could they be to? What are they for? Okay, there's a note, you guys. Look at this, guys. It says, heed this warning. That's Disney's handwriting. It says, heed this warning. It's covered in like magic. Oh, wow. It says, please keep the rest of our magic artifacts safe from black and any others who are after it. Black? Black. Do you think that's, that's the, the guy, guy who's been chasing us? He's wearing a black suit. This key unlocks the secrets that I've kept hidden all these years. This key right here. Whoa. If you can see this, you can be sure that my seven little friends know they can trust you. I can see it. Because <laughs> we said the right spell. Yeah. The magic only appears to those with a pure heart who speak the magic words. Wow. The magic of the ages is hidden far away in artifacts in eastern worlds. Their magic words, you say. But if a threat awakes them, beware the traps we've set. Your lives could be in danger with the task that waits you yet, Walt. And then look, there's a secret <gasps> message right that's here. The, that's the thing. That's the same. That's what we saw. That's in the, the same cave. writing that we saw in the cave. I wonder what it means. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna hang on to this key. I don't think we should take the whole treasure because this is the magic. This is Walt Disney's yeah. magic. If we take all the magic out of the park, then that couldn't be good. Yeah, that can't be good. So maybe we'll just take the key and one jewel. Each of us one. Each take one jewel. Okay, well they jewel. said to keep the, the key, so that's okay. I'll take this jewel. Take Ooh, one jewel. That's pretty. Let me see that, James. Open it up, James. <gasps> cool. Oh, oh no. What did you pick, Corbin? What's coming? I think he's coming. <gasps> I gotta grab one too. Grab one, grab quick. Grab necklace. I'll grab that. I've got a ruby. 
He's coming. We don't have time to run away. Let's put the rest back and then let's get out of here, guys. Can you believe it? Disneyland. We found the hidden treasure of Disneyland. When we were kids, just hanging at the playground.